Yep, mail call. Two of them. Uh, this one from 67Z, uh, formerly Vortex 67. Good choice. He has two different designs. He has, I said, well, pick one and send it to me because I like them both. And it's very cool. I don't know if you can get it. Pretty sweet. Pretty sweet. So that'll be up on the cabinet. And then I got this cool <clears throat> uh, wicked one from you dizzy. The fire bike. It's pretty awesome, man. I don't know who did this for you, you dizzy, but they did an awesome job. It's a great picture, too. That'll be going up in the cabinet. Today's the uh, 19th, 20th. I don't remember Saturday. Uh, got our first snow today. It was like summer yesterday. <laughs> so we we hit like seventies, and then uh, woke up to snow this morning. It's gone already, but it's still in the sixties. And uh, yeah, so it's in the thirties, but it's sunny and uh, it's real windy. So it's like in the twenties with the wind chill, in the low twenties. Still have a, a bunch of yard work to do, and so I'm going to be doing that next. But see, that tree just won't give up. So I'm waiting for that, I'm waiting for those to drop, and then I'll finish getting the rest of the crap out of the yard. And uh, so I got this, uh, I got that all set up. I just got to pin it there and put the belt on, and then. Uh, And then that'll be good. And my battery's dying, so uh, I'm going to charge it, and then I'll be right back. Okay, hours later, the battery's charged. I have time uh, to continue. Uh, and during that time, the mail came, and I got two more mail calls. Awesome sticker, dude. Yes, I do enjoy all your videos. And um, I'm a little behind, but I will get to them, I promise. Um, <clears throat> Uh, that's a cool sticker, and I never noticed the duck here before in all the mail calls that I've seen about this sticker. I've never noticed the duck, probably because I was focused on the chopper, but still, <laughs> I noticed it now, and it's pretty cool. So, nice sticker, dude. I love it. So, here's a little something from his channel. Hey guys, Chopper's Real One here. The toolbox is done, yes! Well, almost. We, uh, me and Hoon Boy were working on it. We've got the uh, the door on here. It undoes. There's the drawer. Look at that. We just cut down an old uh, old toolbox that we found at the dump. We're buying brand new, like 130 bucks with the cupboard. The other half of it's over there. Don't need that bit. Got an idea for that bit though. And then I got a second mail call. Well, fourth one really. One from Coasty Reed. Excellent sticker. You did a good job on that. Uh, that that Ford truck you're fixing up, that's looking awesome. I can't wait to see it done. And I, I, I wasn't sure about the gray and the red until I saw it. I think that's going to look very, very sharp. So, very cool. And thank you for the sticker. I appreciate it. So, a uh, little something from her channel here. It's one thing after another. You know what happened here? I um, was flipping the door around, had everything taped off ready to go, and of course my hands didn't hold on tight enough, and I dropped the door. So, I'm pretty pissed. This isn't one thing after another, you know, I, I don't even know, but I'm going to have to fix it. Okay, and then up on the cabinet. Okay, so yet another mail call. Ta da! How good's Pennsylvania cooking? It's a great channel. I love her cooking. It's very uh, down the, you know, like basic home cooking, like my mom used to do and my grandmother. Um, very honest cooking. I love her channel. I've been waiting for the sticker for a while. Uh, here's a little clip of uh, her channel. Hi, I'm Helga from Helga's Pennsylvania Cooking, and today I'm going to do something a little bit different. Uh, my favorite dessert, probably one of my most favorite desserts of all time, is pumpkin roll. 
The pumpkin roll are not all created equal. And my favorite is Mike's mom's. She makes the best I've ever had. So today, I'm in her kitchen, and I'm gonna make her pumpkin roll. And it's the first time I'm doing it, you're gonna come over. So, you know, um, I've tried many of her recipes and even a couple of things I don't normally like. Turned out pretty good, I liked it. So, thanks Helga. And uh, I'm glad you like my ride along videos. Hope Hopefully we'll get to those soon, but unfortunately the weather's turned and it's, you know, we've had snow already and it's just, it's probably not going to happen anytime soon, but I still have some footage. If I can find the time to stitch it together, I might throw that up, but, uh, okay, so up in the cabinet. Okay, so we're in the cabinet. You Dizzy's new sticker. Chopper. To get it in focus in frame. <laughs> Chopper's rule one. <laughs> and uh, you're down under on the cabinet because as I'm running out of room, not because you're down under. <laughs> so, so anyway, check out his channel. And Cozy Reed. Check out her channel. She's doing great work on that Ford truck. This is, uh, I forget what year it is. It's an older model. It's nice. Um, and then there's, uh, Vortex 67, C, uh, 67Z, uh, his new sticker right below his old one. So, kind of cool. So, check out all these guys. Ooh, I gotta, I'm gonna have to get a bigger cabinet, huh? Let's see if I can do this, all right. Oops, hopefully I didn't leave anybody out there. Flash, hope you're doing okay, buddy. I haven't heard from you in a while. Not that you're watching this, but uh, just in case. And, uh, Dave, start that camera rolling. I'm sure you've done some work. There we go. Up on the cabinet with all these other fine, fine folks. And, uh, sorry, seems like I'm doing just nothing but mail calls lately, but that's really all I've had time for. Uh, but to be honest, I love my stickers and, um, I appreciate everybody who's sending them to me. Um, work's been crazy. I've been working 10 hour, 12 hour days, and that does not include the hour ride there or the hour ride back. Um, but, uh, I'm making lots of progress there, and um, I actually had one person tell me uh, Wednesday that um, uh, they were happy I was in their life. That's a quote. <laughs> so, uh, And then the couple days before that, I had a guy come up to me and go, it's really nice to have somebody to collaborate with. So that gives you any idea of what the kind of people they had in there before me. Um, so... Um, Hopefully we'll get to that soon. But I, I had some time to put the uh, snowblower on my tractor last week, last Sunday. I had a couple hours to kill. And um, the uh, it worked. Thing turned and did really good. And I noticed something going on funky with the motor, so I shut it off and fixed it. It was just a spring touching the pulley. And uh, I went to start it up again because I wanted to raise and lower it, make sure that works. And... It just went, it just made a sound and nothing. And so I took the starter off, and as you can see, it's chewed pretty bad. So it should the starter, the whole thing, all the way across here should look like here, right? I don't know if I'm, that's coming out very well, but see. So it's, it must have it must have stuck out like this when it was done, and the flywheel just chewed the plastic teeth right off. You know, it's all plastic now. And I'm looking, this spring does not spring back very well. So, rather than mess with that, uh, because I've watched Maddie's videos about how much of a pain in the butt it is to replace these uh, these gears, I'm going to buy another one and an extra gear. And then um, I'll have the other one, I'll put that on right away, and then at some point, when I have more time, uh, I will replace this gear, and then that way I can just swap them out as I need to. Um, but you know, winter's here, so I gotta do something, right? 
so anyway uh so that's it that's it for this week uh the mail calls which have been over the last week right so last week and a half so uh, hopefully everybody had a good thanksgiving and that celebrated and um uh, hopefully i'll have a good weekend so um i'm actually because i've got four days off here um uh let's just say i'm being forced to take time away from work um uh I, I hopefully can get caught up on things around here and can get back to some sort of um, routine. So, all right, that's enough gabbing and talking about nonsense. So, <laughs> anyway, ha have a, everybody have a good time.